to our main event for GCW, I Never Like You. It is set for one fall. One fall. And when the bell rings, the man in charge of the action, senior GCW official, Mr. Adam Galt. Introducing first, in the corner to my right, fighting out of Seattle, Washington. With an official weight of 170 pounds, he is the son of Pacific Northwest wrestling legend, Buddy Wayne. And he is the youngest wrestler to ever be considered all elite. Yeah. This is Nick Wayne. No, he's ready. And his opponent, standing to my left. Fighting out of Essex, England, with an official weight of 221 pounds, representing the United Empire. For over two years, he has been the reigning Rev Pro British Heavyweight Champion. And he is the brand new IWGP United States Heavyweight Champion. This is Will Osprey. the man, hate the man, you gotta respect the accomplishments. Bell to bell, what he's done in RevPro, that historic title reign, and what may be the beginning of another historic reign with that IWGP United States Championship. Of course, in this particular matchup, neither of those championships are on the line. It's just a one-on-one -on -one contest to see who's the better man on this given evening. A very determined Nick Wayne versus Will Ospreay. I can't believe it's here, Dave. I can't believe this is real. Look at the focus on young Nick Wayne. His mom traveled on the loop this weekend to witness this event in person. His late great father, Buddy Wayne, has the best seat in the house, high above. Fett Music Hall. Moondog Ed Moretti, the grandfather of Nick Wayne, watching from home on Fight TV. What up, though, Ed? We have a collar and elbow tie-up to start things out between these two wrestlers. Nick Wayne backed up against the ropes by Osprey. Oh, getting filthy with it right from the get-go. Trying to get in his head. Nick Wayne is 16 years old. Most kids are worried about homework or whether they've been downvoted or some meaningless bullshit. But meanwhile, here's Nick Wayne having to compete with arguably the best in the world. And the fans here in Providence, oh, oh, oh. Not, a, not so supportive of Will Ospreay in this one. I would say they are solidly in the camp of Nick Wayne. Did you see the way Nick Wayne exploded off the ropes? on to Will Ospreay, but that's the thing. Will Ospreay's playing mind games with the younger and more easily manipulated Nick Wayne. Nick Wayne holding onto the arm, into the hammerlock he goes, to the side headlock on Will Ospreay. Look at the emotion on the face of Nick Wayne, the young pillar, the youngest wrestler ever to be certified as All Elite. And probably the youngest wrestler to ever main event to GCW show as well. Yeah, that, all of those things. One of the young pillars, a close friend of, uh, of Jordan Oliver. These two became fast friends in GCW. 
training together, traveling together, sharing their passion for this business. Nice head scissors from Nick Wayne. And there you go, Pats. Will Ospreay on top of the head. Will Ospreay can't believe it. Nice arm yes. drag. Follows up with the drop kick and kips right back to his feet. This is Nick Wayne's time to shine. Will Ospreay so confident and rightfully so, but you can't be too confident when you're facing someone like Nick Wayne, someone who's this talented and this hungry. Wayne charges in, looking for maybe a monkey flip up placed on the top rope by Osprey. Wayne able to kick away at the chest. Big leapfrog. Boot to the midsection of Osprey. Center of the ropes. Went for the leapfrog, but caught on the shoulders. And dropped throat first on the top rope. And a big boot from Osprey. Takes Nick Wayne off his feet. Unbelievable precision offense by Will Osprey. Absolutely unreal as he takes a look with disdain and a little bit of curiosity. Who is this 16-year-old wrestling sensation? How can he even hang with me the way he is right now? That's gotta be what's going through Osprey's mind. As Nick Wayne backed into the corner. Lighting him up, chopping away at the chest. Simulating eating the heart of young Nick Wayne. The devious mind of Will Ospreay. Elbow to the back of the head from Ospreay. I'm sure Ospreay would like nothing more than to feed his ego and, and stop the success, stop the rampant rise of, uh, of our boy Nick Wayne. Good Set into the corner with great momentum right there, just colliding with the turnbuckle back first. Trending number six now on social media. Keep using that hashtag. Everybody has their eyes glued to their TVs right now for Will Ospreay and Nick Wayne. The match Nick Wayne dreamed of, the match Joey Janela and GCW made possible, and the match to his credit that Will Ospreay was willing to sign on and do. Very selective about where he appears. Big body slam from Ospreay. Off the ropes he comes. Price down with the elbow across the chest. Cocky cover though, not gonna beat Nick Wayne like that. Cocky cover, but it also uses up no energy. He's getting just the most bang for his buck, if you will, because I don't think this is gonna be a, a, a short one at all. Youthful exuberance of Nick Wayne. I don't think he's gonna go out easy. Trying to mount some offense, shots to the midsection of Will Ospreay as he's back on his feet now. Nick Wayne sends him into the ropes. But Ospreay quickly into an abdominal stretch variation. Indeed, got it locked on as well. Right in the middle of the ring, nowhere near the ropes to force an immediate break of the hold. Osprey's playing Nick Wayne like a guitar, very disrespectful. Still with the hold cinched in, referee asking if he's had enough. He might not get the submission with this particular hold, but he will take away the energy. He will wear down Nick Wayne. He's trying to feed off the energy of these fans, these supportive GCW fans here in Providence. And with that energy of the people, Nick Wayne able to create some separation via hip toss, via forearm smash. Whatever it takes, punches of, and, uh, and forearm shivers in bunches. Osprey handspring, backflip lands on his feet. Nick Wayne with the save. Oh, no! Nick Wayne caught him! Key maneuver for Nick Wayne, but he can't follow up with an immediate cover. He what has Osprey stunned and down on the mat, though. Stunned on the mat, though, indeed. Nick fucking Wayne, I love this. Let's take another look at that one. Both men showing their agility with the handspring. Able to land on his feet was Osprey, but Nick Wayne handspring into the cutter. And now a flurry of offense here from Nick Wayne. Nick Wayne has the decorated veteran in trouble. Fisherman suplex for the bridge. One, two. Only two. Unbelievable main event. Unbelievable to be trending at number six in the world. Osprey, Wayne, once in a lifetime. Nick Wayne looking to follow up here, pulling Osprey back up, going for maybe a dragon suplex. 
Can he get the maneuver though? Osprey breaks the full Nelson and connects with the elbow. Osprey drawing the booze of this crowd. This crowd is all about Nick Wayne. Another handspring into the kick. Connects with the face of Nick Wayne. Some of the fans at ringside really on Will Ospreay. I see a fan there with a sign that Mox is better than Ospreay. Well, Mox is. He is the GCW World Champion after all. Indeed. John Moxley is the best in the world, but one of the very best is Will Ospreay without a doubt and showing why right now with the springboard. Picture perfect execution, quick cover, more designed to tire Wayne out, I think, than to get the actual win at this point, but you gotta keep trying. You gotta keep pushing forward. That's what got Will Ospreay to the very echelon of this business at, at that time, what was thought to be an impossibly young age. But now Nick Wayne has done it even faster. Nick Wayne has gotten to a career height that no one has ever achieved in the history of this business. And that's just for where he is right now in this time, Dave Prezak. Nick Wayne down to a knee trying to block what Osprey has in mind. Now Kawada style kicks to the face. Absolutely vicious and ruthless. But Nick Wayne lands on his feet and connects with a forearm shot. Off the ropes he comes. But Osprey had it scouted. Spinning backbreaker from Osprey right over his knee. And the back of Nick Wayne has seen better days. And the young back of Nick Wayne may have done some serious damage to the knee of Will Osprey. Yeah, trying to shake some life back into that leg. Doing damage to his opponent, damaged himself. And Nick Wayne slowly rising back to his feet. Clothesline over the top into the floor goes Nick Wayne. For Nick Wayne, this isn't a trend, this isn't a hobby, this is a family business taught to him by his father. Passed down from generation to generation of the Wayne family. And that's something that Will Ospreay doesn't have, have the benefit of despite his achievements, his accolades, his world championships. And his United States Championship. Yes. Before. Grabbing hold of the hair of Nick Wayne, pulling him up as they climb the ropes in the corner. Standing on the second rope, Will Ospreay looking for maybe a suplex. Trying to get enough leverage to bring him back inside the ring the hard way, but forearms now from Nick Wayne. Connects with a third, but one from Ospreay in retaliation. And Ospreay just has that look of disdain. The ego of Ospreay is being challenged by the young upstart. Wayne holding onto that top rope. Big boot, trying to knock Nick Wayne to the floor, but he holds onto those ropes once again, staying on the apron. And here comes Will Ospreay, building up ahead of Steve. Now here comes Nick Wayne, code red. One, two. Oh, oh my so God. close. Dave so Prezak. very close. He almost had him right there. Nick Wayne almost had the job done. Only two, says the official. Wayne staying focused. Gonna maybe try to go for that suplex again. Let's take another look. Right into the code red, he rolled. Beautiful code red. And going for the dragon suplex on the ring apron. Osprey trying to fight it off. Elbows as he breaks free of the full Nelson. Just measures him with that vicious, vicious headbutt. Sends Wayne all the way down to the floor. Nick Wayne spills down to the concrete, but Osprey still has an offensive attack in mind. Went for the springboard, but Nick Wayne one step ahead, took away his balance, uppercut to the back of the head. Just enough to stun him, Dave. And now Nick Wayne off the top rope. Swanton on the ring frame. Unreal. Took a huge risk right there, did Nick Wayne. Put his body on the line, and it absolutely paid off. Connecting with Will Ospreay as he was dangling on the ring ropes. Let's take another look. Will Ospreay, he can picture this working in his mind, but our friend Nick Wayne, so quick, so explosive. Watch how quickly he climbs up these ropes. He stunned Ospreay, and then this. Swanton on the ring frame, double impact. The impact of Wayne upon Ospreay and the impact of Ospreay on that ring frame. Both competitors trying to pull it together on the floor, giving it all they have here in your main event. And for Nick Wayne, this is so much more than, than a match. It's so much more than a first main event. It's so much more than the biggest year of his life and his career. 
This is everything to Nick Wayne right now. Elevating Osprey to the second rope, clubbing across the back as well. I can't believe Will Osprey is in a ring right now with Nick Wayne, and Nick Wayne has the people, but Osprey is starting to turn the tide. Able to knock him down off the ropes. But here comes Nick Wayne, he's back up, all the way to the top rope now. Poison Rock no! lands on his feet. Osprey lands on his feet. What agility, and Nick Wayne can't believe it. Unbelievable. Will Osprey's like, I've seen your footage, motherfucker. I know what you do. I know all about the Poison Rana. Forearm shot from Nick Wayne. Off the ropes he comes. Oof. Avoids the Enzigiri. Knee strike from Nick Wayne. Go for the Dragon Suplex. He gets it. Got all of it. Don't turn your back on Osprey. Went for the cutter, but blocked by Osprey. He, did, he was doing Jordan Oliver's cloud cutter there, but he couldn't get it, boys. Oh, oh, oh. He gets it right on his head. Like, on oh, two. Oh, Jesus. Two and three quarters. Wayne looking to follow up. But Osprey's too quick. Sunset, Sunset bomb off the second rope by Osprey, and both men are down again. Sequence of maneuvers and counters. The Poison Rana, Sun Osprey right on top of his head, had that leg hooked, but he was able to kick out. Fight forever, not just the revolutionary wrestling marathon as invented by Game Changer Wrestling, it's also what people want to see. They want to see this fight go on forever. It's that damn good, Dave Prezak. And right now, it's anybody's fight. Such similar styles from both competitors in this contest as they're head to head in the middle of the ring now. Will Ospreay and Nick Wayne, dreams into reality. Forearm from Nick Wayne. Talking a little trash. Ospreay returns the favor. Will Ospreay will not tolerate any of this disrespect. Osprey's fighting mad, he's furious. Both back on their feet now. In Will Osprey's mind, this might be the insolence of a child, but the reality of it is, this is the heart and soul of a warrior. That's what Nick Wayne is all about. Another big forearm from the young prodigy, Nick Wayne, series of forearms, one from Will Ospreay in response takes him off his feet. Not many slash any people in the game have the heart to step up to a hero, to step up to an inspiration, and to do combat with them, to compete at the highest level as they do in Game Changer Wrestling. Ospreay getting him in position. Oh my God. Takes him off his feet with the chop holding onto his wrist. This way, he doesn't even have to bend down to pick up Nick Wayne. Look at the pain on the face of Nick Wayne being brutalized here by Will Ospreay. One of the best wrestlers on the planet today. So many accolades. But the fans don't approve of Ospreay. They never liked you. No. Not only do they not approve of Will Ospreay, they're sending a message loud and clear to Will Ospreay. Indeed, as you said, they praise that they never liked him. But again, as I said earlier, you don't have to like him to respect his capabilities, to respect his achievements. And Wayne is firing back, Dave. Showing his capabilities. Repeatedly forearming Osprey, giving it all he has, Nick Wayne. Gets chopped back down, but he's Wayne, back up. Super kick. Super kick to the back of the head. Damn it, no. Osprey following up. God damn it. One, two, no. Nick Wayne kicks out. Nick Wayne is still in the fight, and Will Osprey cannot believe it. Getting behind Nick Wayne, giving him that encouragement. Osprey, butterflying the arms. Wayne goes up. 
across the shoulders of Osprey. Wade turns it around, did Brazek! Did it, no! So close! Charges in to the second. Muso press, DDT! Nick Wayne is on a date with Destiny! Cloud Cutter! Cloud Cutter! Cloud Cutter! Two! Two and three quarters! The fans insisting that was three! Referee holding up two fingers! That close! He was that close! we might have lost the replay on that one. I wanted to see it, because as you said, I'm not one to doubt our senior official, but I wanted to see that again myself to see if that really was a proper kick out. Oh! No! no! Takes his head off with the lariat, does Will Ospreay. Ospreay. Signaling he's gonna finish him off. Butterfly in the arms of Nick Wayne. No, Nick Wayne cannot be denied. Oh, got a roll. Bridging back. He got no. Only two. Another kick from Nick Wayne. Knee strike. Huge knee. Osprey's down. Love cutter got turned around. Osprey connects. And again. Hooks the leg. Two. No, Nick Wayne with the shoulder up. Like Osprey hit a variant of the clown cutter on his own, but Nick Wayne will not be denied. Oh, Jesus. Osprey. This could be it. Cover. One, two. 